Missions don't always work out. Keep looking forward.
It looks like we're making progress. The resonance area is getting deeper, and our resonance sync rate is improving. <sighs> it's not a big deal or anything, but... The thing is, I keep having this dream lately. It's of when my father and brother were still alive. They... they got along so well. They talked about their dreams a lot. My brother looked up to my father. He worked hard every day to try and be like him. And I think my father was proud of my brother. I could tell he had really high hopes. But one day, bandits suddenly attacked the port and my father lost his life. Just a few months later, I was told that my brother had gone missing in the Ashlands. Losing two people I loved, one after the other. Oh, it's a fact to me now. There's nothing I can do to change it. Just... In my dream, the two of them are always arguing about something. Somehow, the more memories I touch, 
The less sure I am which of them are real. I'm scared. If we keep doing tests like this, maybe something terrible will happen. I don't know what that might be. But if something bad does happen, I don't want you to get caught up in it. Yeah. <sighs> I'm sorry to bother you with something so silly. But I feel better after talking about it. I think I'm okay now. Sorry for making you worry. So this is our third time connecting, right? Okay, let's get started then. Moving out. Edric, what's going on with you? I heard what you're planning. Father? Claire, I'm sorry. I can't stay here anymore. Please take care of Dad for me. What for? Why leave? Did that really happen? Claire, let your brother do what he wants. It's not your concern anymore. Again. No problems, I assume. Yeah, we're fine. Next time is the deepest part of the resonance area. I'll fill you in once you get back. The deepest part of my mind. Just a bit more. Just a bit further. And I know I'll find something. Hey, 
Hey, good work, you guys! The last mission gave quite a boost to the resonance sync rate between you two. In theory, we should be set to make a resonance area connection at the deepest level, but... Hmm. Do you have any concerns moving forward? Yeah, I can do it. Let me help. I'd like to know... about my past. No, it's something I need to know. All right. Thank you both. To be honest, I don't know what it will be like when you connect. You'll have to play it by ear. So if anything seems like it'll go wrong, tell me, and I'll call off the test. Okay, I'll start getting ready. Thanks for your help. What's happening? Ah! You killed him! What? Claire, what's going on? Huh? Your vitals are all over the place. You will adopt his death. What? What are you talking about? I don't understand. Don't play innocent. You killed him! No! Damn it! I can't disconnect! The residence area warp is too big! Claire! Claire! Hang in there! Hey! Pay for what you did! No! No! Leave me alone! Is... Is that... No, I can't! I won't drag you into this! Leave me! Claire is still in a coma. During the mission, her brain activity started spiking, and you went through a forced disconnect. I'm not sure, but Claire may have consciously pushed you out of the resonance area. But there's no sign that Claire herself disconnected. Her consciousness is still deep in the resonance area. That's my hypothesis, at least. I'm so sorry. I'm responsible for this. I knew Claire had doubts, but I sent her in anyway. But testing this technology was my idea. <sighs> no, beating myself up about it won't help. First, leaving Claire in this state is extremely dangerous. The thread connecting her mind and body is fraying, and if it snaps, she won't come back. If you can reconnect to Claire's resonance area, you might be able to guide her out. But her mind is barred right now, so we can't even do that. Well, there might be one way. I told you that resonance areas can be archived, right? We finally got done transcribing the data. It took a really long time, though. So if the archive works, we should be able to make a copy of Claire's resonance area. If you connect to that copy and are able to untangle the memory node inside, that might provide a clue on how to get through Claire's mental barrier. 
Got it. I'll do what I can on my end. I'll perform a final check on the archive status and prepare it for connection. Hey, we'll save Claire. I swear it. You should be in the archived resonance area now. It should look just like the real thing. Well, it's based on an exact copy of the data we got from the original, after all. However, there's a chance the memory node might appear different from before. First, investigate the surroundings. If you see him again, you come straight to me. Is that clear? anything of value? The info we gathered from the memory node here will be entered into the database as usual, but it might contain something private about Claire, so I'll restrict access and won't look. I think you should, though. I have a feeling that if you do, it'll help Claire. Have a look when you get back, okay? Gotcha!
Ash levels will not hinder the mission. Take care, everyone. Let's end this quickly. They explode when they die.
Okay, instruments are green. We're counting on you today. So it can't take long. That'll be okay, right? Yeah, no problem at all. Thanks, Dad. Dad sure is taking his time. Did he and Edric make up? I'd like to go and see, but Edric said he wanted to talk to Dad alone. Resonance area warp is a bit smaller now. That must mean you learned something, right? It's one step at a time, but I think we're closing in on the core of Claire's mind. Okay, I think you've uncovered a lot of the puzzle. We should be close to accessing Claire's real resonance area. Let's get started, friend.
you still found no trace of Edric's trail? It's no use. The ash is just too dense. We sent a ship, but we won't find him like this. You know what kind of a person he is? He must have factored all of this into his plan. I knew he'd do something after he left his home, but attacking his own father like that... Luckily, Claire doesn't understand what happened. Let's keep this a secret for her sake. Wait a moment. Are you telling us to lie to Miss Claire? Think about it. Patricide in the House of Victorious? Our name would be stained forever. It isn't just Claire. We have to keep this from everyone. We can say that bandits did it. I suppose we have little choice. I'll hurry up and prepare a message to send to nearby ports. You all can take care of the rest. I remembered. Those who knew of my brother's flight never spoke of it, and I couldn't recall what really happened. Months later, word of Edric's death came from across the Ashlands. When I heard of it, I drowned in false despair. You truly intend to take up your father's mantle and become a God Eater? Yes. I will defend the pride of House Victorious and my father's will with my own hands. I... I am the eldest daughter of this house. Standing up in a time of need, you are truly a marvel. <laughs> the strong daughter who had lost her family. That was the role I continued to play. was helpless. There was nothing I could do. I was unaware of my brother's crime, and blindly assisted him in killing my father. My actions took my father, Randall Victorious, a noble man from everyone. I volunteered to become a God-eater to atone for what I had done. But at the same time, I turned my back on the truth. So, are you about finished? Okay, I have the materials I need. I'm sure we'll be able to get into Claire's head now. Let's get to planning when you get back. doing here? I wanted to keep you out of danger. This is something that I have to solve on my own. 
I'm sorry. You'd never abandon a member of your family. I finally figured it out. What that thing is. It has to be the sense of guilt I feel for what I did in the past. You remember your mother. You ignored your father's warning. Yes. I kept myself from knowing about my brother. I just wanted them to get along again. You told your father my brother. You lied to him. Yes. I betrayed my father's trust. All for his selfish wish. It is your fault your father died in your mother's hands. You are his killer. Yes. I was complicit in his death. There was nothing I could do. You're entirely right. It's as though I killed him myself. Forgive me. I tried to ignore you. I tried to forget you. But you're important. You mustn't be forgotten. You are afraid. Afraid of being blamed. Afraid of being reviled. Yes, I was afraid. Of the anger and sadness of those who mourned my father. I was fully aware. You meant to atone for your sin by taking up your family name. That's right. Even though doing so would never erase what I'd done. But now, I'm done. I won't run away from you. I won't run away from my past. A core engage? It's like you and I have become one. Listen, I want to bear the burden of what I did in the past. So please, lend me your strength.
It's really over. I was finally able to face my own past because you were there with me. I became a God Eater only to deceive myself and simply pretended to carry on my family name. Now I can uphold the House of Victorious in my own way, with my own will. I owe you so much. Thank you. Listen, I said that I didn't want to put you in danger like that, but that isn't the entire truth. I didn't want you to see the wrongs I'd committed, how weak I was. My pride caused this. I'm sorry. I wanted to handle it on my own so I wouldn't cause you any more trouble. But in the end, I was just a huge burden on you. You think so? Well, sure. I guess no matter how much trouble you caused me, I wouldn't really mind either. Boss! Claire! Do you read me? That's Keith. No! I got through! Are you two okay? Yes, we're both fine. I'm sorry for making you worry like that. Phew! Thank goodness. You're okay then. Hold on just a sec. I'll pull you out. Initiating disconnection sequence. All right. Shall we go home? to me all this time. Thank you so much for that. Let's always be there for each other. Okay, is everyone here? The initial round of core engage testing is basically complete. You really did some incredible work. Yeah, I'm glad the two of you came out of it all right, but... We ran into a lot of unforeseen problems, and I apologize for that. No, the problem was that I didn't put my whole heart into it. Well, let's just use what we've learned, okay? Keith, what's the outlook for getting Core Engage to work in the field? Let's see. We've learned that to get deep into a resonance area, handling memory nodes, or rather, facing memory nodes, is critical. That, and we need better prep and calibration to match up individual resonance profiles. Yeah, I can promise more stable operation from here on, though. If you're confident enough to say that, we'll be fine. For now, let's celebrate today's success. Party! Well, you really went above and beyond again. Yeah, I don't know what we would have done without you. Yeah, you pulled me out of a real fire. Oh, about the resonance area test. Maybe I just didn't know my limits, but... Huh? Did something happen there? No. It's not that <sighs> an issue, but...
What's the matter? The party isn't over, is it? Huh? The Aragami inside Ein is... roaring! It wants to get out! It's running wild! It'll break free! It'll tear Ein's body apart to get out! I guess it's no use trying to hide it from you. I don't have a lot of time left. My expiration date as a God Eater is coming up soon. I'd say six months or so. I'd like you to keep this between us here, if you could. Thanks. Thank you. 